The average American retires in their 60s, but planning for your retirement should start well before that. WBZ's Courtney Cole is here this morning with a look at how Americans are saving. Courtney? Lawrence, Aleem, and Kate, I know the conversations about money, they can get a little touchy, and it's been a challenging few years financially. So let's start here. How many of you feel like you're on track with your retirement savings? Okay, while you're thinking about that answer, let's take a look at what a few others said in a bank rate study. 56% say they feel behind. 37% who participated said they feel significantly behind. And only 25% said that they're actually contributing more to their retirement savings this year compared to a year ago. The study also pointed out that it's actually older workers that are more likely to feel behind, but experts say no matter how old you are, you need to have a plan. The main takeaway here is that saying, I don't know how much money I'll need to retire is really an unacceptable answer. We need to start sort of penciling in some estimates so we can sort of achieve our goal. Because if we don't know what our goal is, how in the world can we achieve it? Now, nearly a third of workers who are participated in this same study say that they feel like they need more than $1 million to retire comfortably. But whatever that figure may be for you, experts like the bank rate analyst you just heard from moments ago encourage you to explore this figure. You can either use a retirement calculator, you can find online, or by getting help from a financial planner. Kate, Liam. All right, good tips. Courtney, thank you. I don't think I can ever retire. I don't think I can. Yeah, you put it into the calculator yeah. and then it adjusts for everything else and you're like, I'll retire <laughs> when I'm 100. I'm too expensive. <laughs> uh, <laughs>